Residents of Victoria Garden City, VGC, held its rescheduled governorship and state assembly election earlier slated for Saturday, 18th March. On Sunday, 19th March, due to the refusal by the residents to vote outside their estate gate for security reasons. Plus, TV News correspondent Emmanuel Olubaboku was, was at the polling units and thus reports. As early as 8 a.m., Officials of the Independent National Electric Commission, INEC, arrived at the Victorian Garden City, VGC, in the Lekki area of Lagos to set up for the conduct of the governorship on state assembly elections in 10 polling units, which was postponed from Saturday. <laughs> Voting began right on time at 8.30 a.m. in some of the polling units located in the VGC park. This rescheduled election, which was to have held on Saturday, 18th March, was shifted to 19th March due to the residents of Victoria Garden City VGC's refusal to vote after INEC relocated the polling units from the back outside the gate of the estate, as they said security was not guaranteed outside the estate. The governorship candidate of the Action Democratic Congress, ADC, Funshaw Dirty, whose polling unit is in the VGC, scolded INEC for the poor arrangement, saying the situation is unfortunate. Obviously, we had the hiccup yesterday, so which was unfortunate, but we are here today, um, and people seem to be uh, pursuing things in an orderly fashion. The, um, the turnout seems to be a bit lower than we saw yesterday, which is a bit worrying, but um, it's early in the day, and we are hopeful that um, people will turn up in larger numbers. A former president of the Nigerian Bar Association, Olumide Akbata, also said it was illegal for INEC to change the location of the polling unit of the VGC residents, however expressed satisfaction over the turnout of events at the polling unit. We plan plans to fail, so uh, our modus here is to always plan to ensure that we have a proper, uh, that things move smoothly. So I'm happy that it has happened. I'm, however, unhappy that it had to come to this. Uh, all that happened yesterday was really quite frustrating uh, and then unfortunately the unfortunate uh, the unfortunate uh, the innuendos that were that were being uh, that was going around town that the VGC residents were being entitled or or elitist no this is the designated polling unit uh, it's called VGC Park however during the course of the election at around 2 30 p.m. There was a bit of a scuffle as part of faithfuls were in disagreement, leading to a bit of a fight. Although the quick response by the security personnel on site eventually led to a calm in the park where the polling units were located. A Labour Party spokesman, Aki Olaoye, made comments on the general conduct of the election, stating his disappointment at INEC not being able to learn from the outcome of the presidential election. Many of us were looking forward to peaceful elections, uh, fair play, as we call it, you know, uh, transparent. Uh, safe to say that INEC has been somewhat disappointing, given some of the events from the presidential elections and um, how we thought they would um, become a lot more efficient, a lot more competent. But we've even seen a worse outcome of the state elections from uh, polling agents, from presiding officers not showing up at uh, polling units to late arrival of materials, even to placing polling units outside of designated areas. At the end of the voting exercise at the polling unit, the Labour Party eventually had an upper hand. Moreover, despite the earlier misunderstanding between party members and the residents, everyone returned to their various homes with a smile. Emmanuel Ulububukun, Plus TV News. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.